In this video, we will be talking about Bay Suzy possibly leaving the entertainment industry. But before I proceed, if you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and please click the notification bell for future updates. Bay Suzy feels there is little in common with his character in the series Duna. Before focusing on becoming an actress, Suzy was one of the members of the K-pop group Miss A under the company JYP Entertainment. When reading the script, Suzy even felt like something had stabbed her stomach because her character her situation was very similar to hers. She also recalled that when she was actively promoting as a K-pop idol, she was used to putting her feelings aside. She said, At that time, I didn't realize I was going through a difficult situation. Some people think I'm running away, but what I'm really doing is trying not to get carried away with my own feeling. I try to focus on other things. Even though my experience is different from Duna, I'm still trying to understand her. In my early 20s, I didn't have the opportunity to feel pain or experience express my emotions like Duna. I always talk to myself. I can get out of this business at any time so the project I'm working on can be my last project. That thought motivates me to always do my best at any time. Meanwhile, in the romance series which was premiered last October 20 on Netflix, Susie plays the titular character of Iduna, a member of a girl group called Dream Suite who suddenly retires from the entertainment industry despite being at the peak of her popularity. Duna moves to a share house at a college town where she met and gets entangled with a naive college freshman Lee Won Chun, played by Yang Se Chung. On the other hand, the idol turn actress is a highly skilled CF queen. She's been called a CF queen or commercial film queen, aka endorsement royalty, for her ability to sell a range of products from food and beverages to clothing and cameras. In 2013, she earned more than 10 billion won or 8.7 million US dollar and bug over 14 endorsement deals. Bid to demonstrate that fame isn't everything. In an episode of talk show Healing Camp in 2013, she revealed why she cried at a press conference earlier that year. She shared, I could bear physical exhaustion but I couldn't express the scars I received from the people. 